Hi there, thanks for joining me. This is Andrea with GardenUpCreativity.com and this is the project we're making today. It's a cute little um, shower favor box. My sister's baby shower is this weekend and I wanted to make a couple favors for it. So, to get started, we need a piece of Marina Mist cardstock and the envelope punch board. This cardstock measures five and a half by five and a half and what you're going to want to do is put your cardstock in and then put the corner to where the two is and punch and score and then slide it on over to three and then punch and score then rotate it and line up the little tail here at the bottom of the punch with the first score mark it's about um, two and a half but all you have to do is, is line up the the score the previous score mark with the speech bubble and punch and score and you're going to want to do that to all four sides and then I'm going to round the corners or round the points using the other edge the other side of the punch okay and then that's that okay then you're going to want to take get your scissors and trim up the um Where'd my scissors go? They're missing. They're hiding. Okay. Um, there is a narrow side and there's a wider. So what you're going to want to do is cut the, the score line from here to here. Stop at that point on this side and then down here at the bottom too. And then I'm just going to cut in a little notch like that. Basically you're just cutting off the little um, the score line. Okay, and then fold on all of the score lines. So then we're going to put this box together using glue dots. Uh, you're going to want to find the, well you'll do the top, so first you're going to put a glue dot on the bottom top. Oh no, sorry. You're going to put glue dots first on the flaps. Fold the flaps up and put a glue dot in the top corner. One on each flap. Yeah, I stick to my fingernails too. That's fun. And then you're going to want to fold it out and then up into that, like that. Do the same thing to the other side. Like that. Now you're going to want to put the glue dot in the center here. And then you're going to want to make sure it's nice and square when you fold it. You don't want to fold it over too far. And then press that together. And then put a glue dot here on this side. And then one here. And then one at the bottom. And then fold it over like that. And then put your hand on the inside of it, and then reach down and press the glue dots together. And then this just folds into the box, like that. So that's the back of the box. We're going to decorate this side. 
you're going to want to take a piece of paper on uh, using the Marina Mist um, Designer Series paper. Um, it's going to be two by two and three quarters. And we're just going to apply some snail to the back of that. And then center that. And then we're going to do a little bit of stamping. We're going to use the Baby We've Grown stamp set. This came out in the Occasions catalog last year and it carried over. We're going to use the little shoes that say cute boy on it. So we're going to take our Stazon ink and ink that up really well. Stazon ink in black stamped onto Whisper White. And then you're going to take the Marina Mist ink pad and we're going to use blender pens today. So what, how I get the ink how I get the ink to be on the lid when it's close you just kind of give it a squeeze like that and then it, it distributes some ink onto the lid. And then you take your blender pen and pick up a little color. In color, I just colored the part of the shoe that has the little gingham stripes, or the plaid stripes, I guess. Being very careful not to get on the laces or the little in, or the inside of the shoe or the outside of the shoe. So, and to save some time, I've already finished a pair. So you're going to want to get your one and three quarters punch and punch out the, the pair of shoes. And then I took another piece of Marina Mist and I um, cut out um, from the Starburst Framelits the second smallest. So that's the smallest, the next one up. I, I um, die cut one of those out of Marina Mist. And we're just going to layer that on top with some dimensionals. And it's just big enough to peek through just a tiny bit. I think it looks really cute. And then we're going to take some of the Marina, Marina Mist Chevron um, ribbon here. And then cut a couple inches past the uh, top of the box and then take some of the Whisper White Baker's Twine and I'm going to tie a knot just a plain simple knot at the, at the top of the box and you can always tighten it after you've gotten the knot tied to But you don't want it to be too tight because you do want the ribbon to slide off. It's just to help keep the box closed and add a little bit of fun to the box. Fun factor. Okay. And then to get this put on, we're going to use sticky strip because we're going to stick it onto the ribbon. Find the end here. Just about an inch long. And then to make sure you're getting it on straight, you want to make sure it's lined up and then stick it right down the center. And then put that right on top of that. So this is the cute little party favor that I'm making for my sister's shower. I hope you like it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.